Hey everyone, my name is Leanne Wilson. I am the manager of fitness and well-being here at McMaster University. We're standing outside the doors to the Pulse Fitness Center, which is currently being renovated and expanded to better serve our students. So we're gonna give you a little sneak peek today. Come on in. When we reopen, that front door will be a wide door for all of where everyone's gonna come in. To my right here would be the front desk where you will check in and scan your student card. Come on, let's walk through the space. For those of you who were around before we closed pre-pandemic, um, this was the main Pulse floor, but it's changed significantly. We've moved all the offices and the previous closed off space. There's a new stair, <laughs> stairwell that comes up right through here. And when we put uh, the equipment back in, when this project is done, we're going to have all kinds of new equipment, including this floor, mostly weight equipment, plate loaded, racks, platforms, and selectorized. Some of you will recognize those old stairs. So this was the end of the pulse previously. We sort of stopped right about here, and then the climbing wall started. So I'm gonna show you all the new space that we have. Not only are the offices moved that we've pointed out before, but that we've got all this new space. To make the Pulse more accessible, we now have an elevator within the Pulse, which will allow members to access all three stories, as well as there's a second stairwell over there that we're gonna be going up today. This beautiful lit sunken space is where the Featherstone climbing wall is going to be. So we're gonna have a brand new climbing wall, bouldering area, and uh, with a view. So we're coming upstairs to the cardio floor. This has had a significant expansion. As we come up here to my left, this entire space is all brand new and we're going to have a cardio theater where you can watch a football game while you're running on a treadmill. Coming through here, some of you may recognize this mezzanine from before. We will again have a significant space full of cardio machines, an area to stretch, and a view of the uh, lower weight room floor. We have a couple washrooms, which are gonna be right within the pulse. So you don't have to go so far in order to do what you need to do. <laughs> and then coming down here, we're entering the women's only area. So we have a small studio where we will have a virtual fitness screen where women members can pick a class and do something on their own or work out with a friend. And coming down into this space, we have an entire room that's going to be dedicated as a women's only space with strength equipment, some cardio equipment, and complete privacy. Just continuing along the cardio floor, this is fun, we have a view of our current temporary pulse through the windows, which of course will be returning to a gym space. So we've got windows on both sides, you get to kind of see what's happening in the building. And one of the great things is that we have a stairwell here at the front of the cardio section, so you don't have to walk all the way through the gym in order to access the cardio machines anymore. You can come in the front door and come right up the stairs. So we have two stairwells and an elevator now in this space where we had one small one before. This little nook here is familiar. That's where we had our rowing machines. And we'll be using every inch of this space to fit in lots of great equipment for you. Okay, so these are the stairs we came up earlier. One thing I wanted to mention was that these have been designed to be running stairs. So if you actually want to get in a little cardio without a machine, a great way to Boost your heart rate in between sets. So we've got to the third floor now. Here's our elevator door. 
and we're gonna show you the studio. So we have three studios upstairs. These are all for group fitness. Of course, they'll be wide open for use when classes aren't in session. This is the smallest of the three studios, which can be used for small group training, has an amazing view. I think my favorite feature of the new Pulse is the new group cycling studio. We're going to have all brand new cycling bikes. So excited about this. You can see that it's bigger than the studio we had before. It also has higher ceilings. It's gonna have better ventilation. A really state-of-the-art space. And then over here, we have our main fitness studio. So most of our group fitness classes are gonna be in this space here. There's a storage unit for equipment. All of the Pulse spaces will be equipped with uh, audio-visual, so we'll have, there's a little noise there, we'll have uh, great speakers and really good music going. And then finally, just outside the group fitness area, we have some offices that will be for staff. This one here will be my office, so if you wanna come and say hi, just knock on my door. Thanks for joining us on this sneak peek of The Pulse. Very excited to welcome all of you back in the fall. It's going to be an amazing space. We can't wait to see you Marauders.